we're nearing the end of a year-long set of deployments. And my team was at a restaurant in Kopchagai, Kazakhstan. I turned and looked at the uh, TV and I just see the, the planes going into the tower and just like, oh my God. Our country was under attack. It was just a huge letdown when we saw that these guys had the audacity to attack us. An NCO comes into the tent. He says, hey, we've got a mission for you. We need a team to go down into the south to start an insurgency from scratch. There's no standing army, no nothing. So we would be going into the Taliban's backyard. And they weren't going in with anybody that was armed. They were going in with a man named Hamid Karzai that no one had ever heard of. Initially, I just thought he was another warlord. They thought, you know, hey, we're going to meet some, some badass. And when they met Karzai, the first thing that Captain Amarine thought was, he looks like Gandhi. What I feared most was that the Northern Alliance would win in the North, make their way into the South, fight the Pashtun, and seize control of the country. What we were doing in the South was working. It told us that we had a hope of preventing the Civil War that seemed so inevitable. Then something uh, went wrong. From the landing zone, we got a call up and said, Americans are dying, please hurry, please. And uh, you could hear the strain in his voice. Just kind of unreal, you know, like no way. Just what the hell. 